Hi everybody, I have a project to share with you. This is an altered paintbrush I made for the Verve Stamps blog hop this month and it was so much fun and I regret not doing a video on it. Um, I was afraid to turn on the camera because I didn't know how it was going to turn out and it was kind of just one of those projects where you just hope that it turns out and I think um, it turned out uh, really nice and I love how it turned out. Um, so I used the vintage vanity paper from Prima and I used a lot of sprays from Lindy's and some trim from the piece by piece and these honeycomb uh, chipboard piece is from uh, Blue Fern Studios and this stamp of course is from Verve Stamps it says life doesn't have to be perfect to be wonderful so I was inspired by Patricia um, Tubeview Master on YouTube and if you all have a link below to her video um, she does these really cool doll uh, mixed media projects and um, so anyway, she altered a paintbrush with, um, and she put a doll on it, and it was really nice. And um, we had gone to uh, Home Depot, and I just picked this up, and I thought, oh, I'll give it a try. And so I did, and I used some acrylic paint to paint it the blue color, and then I used some um, stays on ink and black uh, paint down here. And you can't tell, but it kind of uh, fades up to white. And then, yeah, you can't tell at all. Um, and then I used some cheesecloth back here, and I sprayed it with the dark chocolate truffle. And then I stamped it um, just with um, this stamp here to give it a little bit more texture on the... Um, what is this called? The honeycomb chipboard piece. And you can't tell that it's words, but it just gives it a nice um, effect and more dimension to the project. And um, this is a Prima spray here that I sprayed with uh, Toto's uh, Tornado Black. And then some seam binding here and this Prima flower here. And I put a little gear in the center there. And then a pearl there. And... Um, I randomly put some pearls here because I wanted it to be grungy but girly, so I put the pearls. And then this is a, right here is a clock hand from Prima. Oops, sorry. And then up here um, is a um, uh, wild orchid craft flower. And then another gear and then some more of that um, honeycomb chipboard piece there and then this is the some um, May Arts or with, excuse me that I sprayed um, with the Toto's Tornado Black so that's that and like I said you can find more details on my blog I just wanted to share it with you guys really quick um, so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and thank you guys so much for watching bye